Hello again and welcome to Ndu Dubai Fafa. Hello Indudu natives, thank you again for tuning in for another exciting episode and today I'm tackling a Ghanaian breakfast but of course with my own twist. So yes, this is going to be the salted beef omelette or kermini. Naturally, I'd leave the list of ingredients and measurements including the full written recipe on my blog fafagilberts.com so please do check it out. And if this is your first time, you're welcome, thank you very much for tuning in. To start off this recipe, starting from the bottom left, we've got the salted beef, which I have diced. Then I've got my onions, which are my banana shallots, but you can use any onions of your choosing, some tomatoes, green peppers, as well as some green chilies. Of course, to a bowl, I'm adding my eggs and I'm just going to beat the eggs until they are well combined. Now, if this is your first time and you haven't clicked the subscribe button and you do like what you see so far, please do so and activate your notifications to all so you do not miss any future videos. To a saucepan, I've melted some coconut oil and to that I'm adding my salted beef pieces. This is to allow that umami and salty flavor to infuse into the coconut oil. Now this is going to fry gently for five minutes on that medium to low heat to allow that infusion to take place. The next thing I'm going to add are my chopped green chilies. Now these are going to add some residual heat to the oil as well. And I will fry this for about two minutes now to balance that flavor i'm adding my banana shallots as i mentioned earlier you can use any onions that you do have available now particularly the shallots that you get from ghana they are sweeter and incredible now say more intense in flavor anyway so after two minutes of frying i'm now adding my green peppers yet again just allow it to absorb the flavors that i've introduced this to so at this point i think i need to now bind this together by adding my beaten egg exactly <laughs> The next thing is I'm going to be adding my chopped tomatoes to it. Yes, and that is the last thing that I do add. Now, I have omitted salt from this recipe because, of course, I've used the salted beef. So, yes, it is perfectly spiced in that sense. And what I'm going to do is just cover this just to trap that steam in. So, the steam would also cook the top part of the omelette and you end up with a crunchy bottom but a nice and moist omelette at the top. So here I'm just going to make sure that it's not caught to the bottom of the frying pan because this is not a non-stick frying pan. And that just looks perfect. So here I'm just transferring it into a plate and then I had my tea bread. Now I did share excerpts of this recipe on my Instagram and I think it took everybody down memory lane because, you know, during my childhood, I remember we had to actually stand by the gate to look for the tea bread seller or the bread seller, may I say. And when you call them, you will choose the kind of tea bread you want. Others look like very pale in complexion. Others were slightly blush in color and others were darker. And, you know, people had their own choice. And of course, one would add either the butter or they have butter at home so they just buy the tea bread just like that and it's freshly baked and it's nice and soft and absolutely beautiful now i have covered the tea bread recipe already and i'll leave a link in the description box yeah so you can try your hands on it it's absolutely incredible so i just added my salted beef omelette into that tea bread okay really just bite it <laughs> 
I hope I have given you that reason to click the subscribe button and share this channel with your family and friends and invite them over. Yes. And if you do have any suggestions as to what kind of recipe you'd like me to try as well, please don't forget to leave your comments below. Don't also forget to smash the like button and leave your comments. Yes, because that can help the video as well. Naturally, as I mentioned, I'll leave the list of ingredients and measurements on my blog, fafagilbert.com. So do check it out. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat as in Dubai Fafa. So pass by and say hi. Noel, thank you very much for my theme song. And until my next video, Indudu Natives, I love you for you. Loyal subscribers, I appreciate you. Notification gang, you guys are the champion. We love you for you. See you in my next video.